obviously they already know is potentially to be this invoker here. I I don't dare maybe Liquid consider swapping things. I mean, we know ODB to pretty mid dominant. Like uh, we could run into an early clash here. Both teams. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I think we could stronger on that one. So let's see if that's going to be the case. Kuro is going to be the first to drop the cogs. Miracle hoping with the power of the tether and astral. They are going to be taking down Kuro first. First blood goes the way of fly, and we're not done yet. It looks like they're going to follow it up with a second. Secondary kill as they take out Fata. Things could not be going better already for OG in this early skirmish. Yeah. Hmm. But OG don't seem to mind. And we'll have to see if uh, they'll stick with having the Wisp in the mid lane or if they do feel that that top lane is enough of a problem here. And Liquid are trying to make it a problem as they make an approach. Oh, nice catch with the Cog. Sunstrike. Don't get it done. Liquid yeah. get themselves on the board with that. I, I guess that's how you help the one. Like, uh, where the Invoker's the one. No. So he's gonna like fall off early and they're gonna be okay with it, but they make space for him to catch up later. Splinter but Blast. I, that's, that's kind of the issue right now. Like OG has this really strong uh, five men, and you don't really want to be four people to having the, the more Here birds the boards, but. Gets right. his level six, goes top. Let's go, let's put this level six ulti to work. Mind Control shows up with his team, and Jerex is going to be the one to lead things off. No Tail tries oh, to gust them back. Sun Strike's there. Ravage. Sun Strike misses the mark. The Ravage will connect Lockdown No Tail, but Crit's here to link up and help him out. Is it going to be enough? Oh, Bump of the Cogs will separate them. Leaves No Tail alone. They take him down. They will get the response kill, taking down Kuro, making it a one for one split. One that will benefit Liquid here, but they want more. They're looking to move in. Big Splinter Blast. Connects. Can they pop down Crit? He pops the one. They need a bit more. They'll get it. Liquid on the Warpath back, and they're not oh. done. Yet. They're moving it. They're moving in for Fly. Oh, nice. Nuking him down. He tries to burst back, but Matama Man gets healed up, and they'll finish off the Oracle. Big I, early gank movement for Liquid. I think the Clockwork dying kind of worked out for them because if he didn't die, he wouldn't have had uh, like enough stairs uh -oh. to TP bottom. Beastmaster's cutting him off. He is dead. Oh, fought it. Nowhere to run. How's it going? Yells right in his face. Locks him down. And Moon will actually take the last hit there. OG gets their I, own I don't response. Think anyone will, what can they do? Nothing. So OG are just gonna take all this free money on like, the map. Oh boy! What can they do here? Yeah, like, Spotted with the spirits. Like, Link them up. Tipping in heroes, but um, this could lead like, to more disaster than profit like, for Liquid. Oh, take down two. Moon almost goes down. Does get kept alive as the Astro Mup Sunstrike is not oh, going to quite that, be there with the timing, and that, they mitigate the damage splitting so, it between them. So good from Fly. Very quick. Yeah, probably. You know, the Sunstrike will come. He is there, the babysitter. What the heck? And Jerex is just, please don't chase me. He's making him sweat for it, but ultimately uh, OG think, will get I this one. I think rushed it too much. Like, they... This could be a fast one if it keeps going at this rate. What do you? Yeah, I, yeah, I know you're posing the question. Draw, what draw, do you? Just level five. But he doesn't even care, like, you have no Ravage, you have no spell, like... Oh boy, uh, they have a war again, ready! Mind Control's gonna be forced to dish out the Ravage, but it feels more defensive if anything else. They'll still be able to take down Kuro, and now they just wait for the Watermelon Man to appear, and they'll take him down. This this is not looking good for Liquid, they just don't have the tools to stop the momentum. Uh, and now they, now they don't have Ravage. Yeah, but but Tom Man is just like... Liquid exp uh, OG expected like all of Liquid to be there with the Luna, covering the Luna, but... Uh, not one. Yeah. Not one. Like, OG wants to fight, like you can see, they just go as five. It's a Luna, and that's just not enough. They hear the rockets finally gonna come into Roshan, so they know, but it's dead. Almost a KS. <laughs> Dragon yeah, himself spell to protect themselves. Yeah. Uh, Liquid oh has their levels now. Oh, fly. They see him. Yeah, they do. They charge up. Oh, this, this one. will connect like here. Liquid. Roar in the face, but uh, still no pounce from OG. Oh, Miracle funny. from the other side flanks, flanks him here, starts to pop down mind control as best as he can. Meanwhile, they're going to dish out the curse onto No Tail, and uh, yeah. the False Promise will save him up. So now OG can move on to fight for round number two. Jump in from Kuro to look to go for crit here. Meanwhile, mind control pops off the roof. Ravage tries to go for Miracle, but Miracle pops down the ulti, gets a double, gets a triple as he cleans out another. Yeah, he is just beginning to slam down onto Liquid. Kuro, desperate to make it away, will barely make it out, but OG have really just kind of ripped it through it, so. I, I think OG is forcing too much right now. Like, no, OG is really strong, but oh. you don't really have to go high ground. Like, you could just wait out like five more minutes. Oh, My control, friends, oh. come back! He's stuck alone. That was a weird place to stay when they know they have a Beastmaster. Of a fountain right there, so they can't even participate in the defense. Yes, 45 IMG. Yeah. They can't die. Like and the Wisp can just... Yeah, Wisp, yeah. yeah the, if their laning phase oh goes as well. Ouch, ouch! Oh my god! Just took fun and put him in a headlock. <laughs> oh my goodness. 14, 14 minute racks. Yeah. This might be uh, our fastest game. 
of the summit, if I'm not mistaken. This one, I mean, unless I missed it, this is. I think there's like a 21 minute game. Yeah, this could be. Just from the racks. I think you'd wanna right now if you're liquid, you wanna smoke around and kill their supports first, and you drop the wyvern out on the OD. So uh oh, here we go. The pike. Bang, bang. Pops out my control. Oh, okay. I mean, it's the kill on support if you get that curse around uh, miracle or the drow. Kuro tries to go for moon. He does get saved up from the cold embrace. from the team, but I don't think put us Okay, jump in from mind control. Trying to at least burst down Moon. Nice save though, keeps him alive. Miracle says none of that. Drops down the ulti, gets a triple, goes for the ultra, will get it. And OG. I think it pretty much sealed the deal. Lost too hard on yourself. Like, they were kind of put into a corner. Like, it was just really good drafting from Fly. And OG's decision making was really on point. Like, they didn't even bother waiting for a draw six. They just went level 5 and push and got all the advantages they needed. Yeah, do you think you ban the draw or are you just gonna leave it still and uh, try something? Against it. Like, OG just kind of forced Liquid to go aggro with these two supports that need levels and Luna wants levels as well. Like, Liquid didn't even come online. And by the time they came online, OG was like online times 3. Oh? Might get a forgiving pick off here onto Moon who's trying to swipe some eight. This tower noise is an awe. Liquid keep moving forward though. They're gonna run into him right here. A rocket flies, but Matama Man is far in the front. Will get saved up with a cold embrace, but just delays the inevitable. They'll burst through the ice. Miracle now pops BKB. And we'll move right in. Uh, he gets hit, but that's just a saving curse. Not enough to do any catch anyone around. Crit, we're relocating in. They will not be able or they will be able to stop Jerex. Nice astral there. And they will take him down. 44. That's a lot of it. He try one last fight, but a honestly, the OD, the OD out probably like kill someone. Like he has 44 and he's still. He knows, yeah, four step in and ult if he really wants. The sieging creeps alone almost take out a Rax. Oh, and here one, comes Miracle. One hit. <laughs> one hit. Boom. Two hit. Boom. Needed one more. Oh, no, Gets hit with a lucid gleam. Yeah, Matoma says, "Don't do it to my bro." Mind control somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, in the back lines, they're trying to finish off some supports oh, here. Fly goes oh, down. He buys yeah. back. They. We'll be able to take Kuro. Odie's gonna die unless Crit saves him. OD very deep. We'll be able to man up and <laughs> just Matu. crushes Matu. Oh, no. Toilet bro. Gonna be taken down. Oh, Still defending oh, though. Crit missed his link. Oh, I saw that Crit. Crit's one mistake this game. <laughs> you guys play like that, point out any mistake you can find. Oh, ah, oh yeah, yes. secure. <laughs> oh, nice last try. But it does look like OG, on that note, will clear out the final racks. And yes. that will be the towel thrown in. Liquid getting decimated in this one. Their biggest stopping of this tournament. OG emphatically start out with a nice win in game number one in this loser's bracket best of three. Yep. Yeah, that was OG had a plan and he executed it. Perfectly, yeah. I don't think anything went wrong for him. <sighs> but if you're OG, or Liquid rather, you made the call that maybe if they changed the lanes a bit, threw the Tidehunter to the mid, and, and gave Fata, the Invoker, a lane to at least do something, it, it, would that really been potentially Liquid's best shot in this game with the draft they were? Uh, I think they had to do something else. Like, I